Welcome back to the Insane Duo Shadow Pages. It's been like three weeks since we recorded this thing. I don't know why I clapped my hands right there. But, anyway, if you want to know the reason why Connor's going to be quiet for most of the we've seen this. If you want to know the reason why Connor's going to be quiet for a good chunk of this, is because I just recently went, I let him borrow Dream Dot Distance, and he's one, and he's been begging me to finish that game so we can play it. <laughs> Not to mention he doesn't really care for Shadow, so. Yeah. Shadow's my second least favorite Sonic game ever, next to SA2. And yes, we were really that, and yes, we wanted to uh, just skip Digital Circuit because of how much trouble we had last time. I got missiled down a bottomless pit by a worm. <laughs> Black Doom, teach your troops some morality. Looking for cream and cheese, so. I know, but it looks like it, it looks, looks like someone cut off cream's head and put it in a box. That's pretty much what they did for this. Well, then again, they did that. Up we go. Put it on a plane in SA1, so. I don't know. Yes. Bounce. Ah, boing. I just got. That clown was a kamikaze. And we already explained how the morality system in this stage is absolutely fucked up. But... And forgive us if we're quiet, mainly because I'm trying to concentrate and Connor just doesn't care. By the way, if you get in... Kingdom Hearts 3D, part zero, I guess. Hey! <laughs> Sorry if I just made you deaf in anyone. I out of steez. Clearly. I'm just spamming the dive button in order to get to the goal ring. By the way, try and get an A if you can on that thing. Because the first, because the first A is spark dive, and that thing is really fun to use. Yep. You got Spark Dive? Yes. Well, you're gonna be in practice. We're gonna be in practice. We're gonna be in practice for one eight for the hundred acre woods. Yeah. Wait, is hundred is hundred acre woods in this game? Um, no. I'm, I'm just talking about the diving mini game and reaching memories. I don't know. Drive forms in KH2. Yeah. Is the Vela form? Is the Vela form yet? Like, how do you get those forms anyway in battle? Do you? I, how do you get those forms anyway? I'm curious. There's a certain button that you hit during battle that will transform you into them, and you also need drive points in order to use it. It's basically the equivalent of a meter. Mm. You just whack it. Yeah. Yeah. I know. A rampart? Yeah. No, I rammed into a torch. You, it looked like you ran, ran, rammed into a rampart. Uh, a window, actually. Oh, for God's sakes. Get down here, you slow moving platform. Ow, fuck you. <laughs> what? Um, I can't remember his name, but the uh, the guy that teaches you uh, free flow has a point. Do you trust every single stranger that you meet? Neku? Yeah, Neku. He has a point. And just playing, and just playing that game makes makes you want to get the world ends with you. I want to try it out. Heard it's a good game. Yeah. Combat system's a bit weird. Like it's kind of getting getting used to. Boing. 
But the fact that a lot of people were really like the show Minimo Minimamoto fight. Oh crap! Connor just took the game off. And personally, I agree with him. For this point, anyway. Yeah, Cryptic Castle is not one of the best levels in this game, by any means. I call it free flow. You can, you can call it flow motion, potato, potato, I don't care. supposed to do. I think Neku is... you're gonna find... Found a safe one. Shut up, big man. Seriously, shut up, please. Oh, God. This look good. You probably, you might just, probably, you're probably gonna fast forward this, aren't you? Yeah, probably. Depends on how long it takes. Do I need to light all these torches? Yes. Ah, crap! By the way, what the heck? You said green ooze. This is clearly red. Uh, ooze in general. Yeah. Hi, jeez, duplicates. Yeah, this. <laughs> don't bother checking every single chow in this area. None of them are cheese. Yes, you do. No, please stop. shift. Eh, it gets kind of, the first two worlds are kind of boring with it, then, then it starts, then it starts getting exciting once you, once you what reach. What was your second Uh, the, Hunchback. yes, Hunchback's reality shift is the same as Traverse Town, it's kind of boring, but once you get to the grid, things get a lot more interesting. God damn it, I got cock by a cutscene. There we go. You got cock blocked by a cutscene, 
fabulous parting words for this kick for Cryptic Castle. <laughs> I get an A. I don't know. I died twice. Hello, Dream Readers. You look incredibly unthreatening. They're a lot more adorable than the shadows in KH1 yeah. and 2. And cut. Fuck off, man. Why is it that when you help? It's pretty much the only thing this, this boss has going for you. I, I was talking to you about Traverse Town. Oh, okay. That actually is. This is just kind of vague. heck was I aiming at? Spirits, they're on their fat vibes on your side. The music gets kind of cool. Yep. Like First dream eater is the meow wow. Let me guess that's what we'll mm -hmm. So keep the throughout the game and I think you're okay. Pretty much. Central City. This stage has a time limit of seven minutes, I believe. Um, not entirely sure. I think it's seven minutes, either seven or eight. Oh. All right, everyone, strike a pose. Okay, everyone, strike a pose. You get your back up straight. You slouch over, and you stop eating popcorn. <laughs> Shadow, make sure that make sure the cameraman can see you and get all of us. Jeez. <laughs> Awesome. All right, all right. Anyone who smiles, anyone who smiles, you get the you get first pick on human kebabs. Let's go. Also, also I'd just like to mention that my black new voice is horrible. Compared to mine? Compared to anybody's, because mine sounded like an old man. <laughs> I'm trying to make mine sound. Is that seven or eight? Let's see. I pick this up and what do I throw it at again? This one. Sid, your voice is amazing. Oh, this reminds me of something. Sora technically has five people sealed inside of him. Okay, first we have Roxas, then we have Ventus, then we have Shion. She's still in there. Then there's Vanitas, because he's inoperably in there, because Ventus is in there as well. And then the fifth and final one, we have Ansem the Wise. How did Ansem get in there? He digitized himself in all this research and basically used Sora as a backup computer. So Sora is a flash drive. That is weird. Oh, good. Also, oh, good God! Mm. Oh, there's a die, die. There's a scene in Cage 2 where it's rock during the Roxas section. Where it ends up drawing where there is a nobody symbol and a heartless symbol, and Roxas draws a third symbol. People speculate that it could be either the unversed symbol or the, uh, Nobody's really sure which, because you never actually see it. The third symbol? Yeah. That Roxas drew? Yeah. 
I'm pretty sure it would be the inverse symbol, if anything. Mainly because... Well, he's technically living in a dream world, so it could be the dream symbol. He's not really in a dream. He's in a virtual reality. Although, you may go to the grid that's in a dream, in a virtual reality, in a dream. You know what I'm trying to say here. Okay, drop them down so I can kill them. Let's see, fourth bomb should be this way. Spark dive? Oh yeah, I didn't. I used that thing for a long time. You actually gave Fluffy something? Yeah, a potion. It just boosts his stats, he won't give you anything. Yeah, In fact, I didn't even use command I didn't even input commands on on most of your most of your monsters. Most of my dream readers until I re until I reached like the fifth world. Just leaving his name, yeah, well. That's boring. Well I'm a boring person. Your words, not mine. Go ahead and use them. Mm -hmm. Is that what you're saying? Is that what you're thinking to people? Yeah. Maisie, what are you barking at? What the hell hit me? Now meow yeah, well, is on your shirt. Adorable little fucker in me. That rhymed. Yeah, I was just so adorable. That was bad time. Well, that's why I was that's why I called the bad spirit. I named him Baton. Die. You can't really, you can't really gain affinity for Pokemon if you keep it in the PC, so. Well, yeah, but that doesn't mean that just because you don't use it in battle, it doesn't do anything. That's why if you don't want it to battle, keep keep it in the empty, keep it in the sub slot. That's right. That's what I did with Fluffy. And by the way, once we once we actually get that get to that game for the channel, you have to nickname each and every each and every Dream Eater that you use. Because what if I don't want to yeah. What's up here? Oh. Extra life. I could've used that. There we are. these or not. I don't think it was. Um, we weren't. Okay. It's not gonna matter anyway. It's only it's only in the it's only in the games that we're co oping, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. I know what I know what stage is up next. How the hell am I breathing? Now that I'm I'm gonna flip my form. I just can't breathe underwater. Status ailment removing thing. 
Okay. It's basically a full heal. Check items. Shadow, you're incredibly monotone. stuff like that but the actual boosts like attack like attack boost the defense boost that's only that's only a specific character that raised the dream eaters mm. if you want it, if you want it to be on the other character you're gonna, have, you're gonna have to let them use the you're gonna have to go go into the menu swap out the dream eaters and then do all the raising all over again okay now this is a really weird mission oh god <laughs> okay the one that can possibly glitch out on you Glitch is out. I remember Ted during the Brains Crack Run through talking about a glitch where you couldn't complete the mission. Or the dark mission anyway. Yep. Yeah. For this. Ow! Hello, young Xehanort. We. Oh, good god, I'm falling. Ooh. That was close. There's a lot of close instances where you can just up and die. And sword just passed out. Don't feel like that Rico's gonna do the same. I know. Oh yeah, go boom, baby. Oh shit. Oh uh, shit. Oh uh, shit. Uh. I got it. I order you when we get to uh Fusion to just waste my missiles at the very end. Yes. Don't worry, I will. I already had the plan going. Blackbone can't take much more punishment. By the way, there are some there are some s s world diving sections where you really going to have to die know how to dive in. Ah, oh, crap, I missed. Well, I'm going to have to go find a save point. Warp back in. Could try again. Save point. Don't you mean checkpoint? Close enough. And I got another A. Yay, but I didn't get any checkpoint. You already got spark dive. Oh, I'll get it once for warp. Well, at least you can go ahead and... Ah, shit. At least the commands are shared between characters. Ah, oh, you gotta be kidding me. You missed that many. I was on the black fold and decided to say fuck to everything. How is that lock on reticle still on me? They were attacking me first, dickhead. Oh well. Cut. Got to that, I thought I thought he was Neku's partner, because I don't know a thing about what the world's in the U except for Showman and Mamoto. I'm pretty sure everybody has that one game where you don't know an absolute thing about, but you only but you only know there's one this one character in there. Whether it's a boss fight, a certain character, or something. But besides that, you absolutely know nothing about the game. Do you have something like that? Hey, artificial chaos! Karn's going to enjoy you later. <laughs> Karn's crying in the corner. <laughs> yeah, I'm 
I'm not doing a very <laughs> good cry. It's like Ted in Superman 64. I'm glad neither of us have that game. I just don't sound like a chick. I thought the same thing too when I first when I first met the guy. I was like, okay, we got a pretty boy that sounds like a chick. Way to go. I'm not entirely sure about his personality in the, in, uh, the World Ends With You, but given I'd, his androgynous design, I wouldn't be surprised if it's, at least in the Japanese version, it's, um, uh, that, that, uh, homosexual. At least in the Japanese version. I'm gonna go boom. No, I'm not. <laughs> oh, the thing still goes. And I can't use Chaos Blast to while I'm writing. Damn it! How do you only have one of the things so far? You should have more than that by now. Things are very spaced out. Get off and get the thing. They're very spa they're very spaced out. They're more they're more grouped at the end. If anything. Oh crap, the turrets, I hate the turrets, I hate the turrets, I hate the turrets. They can really destroy your black bolt if you're not careful. Nothing down here. Hmm, huh, guess when there was something. Ooh! This, turret! This song sounds kind of cool. Oh well, at least you're back to where you were. Yeah. Run! Run! Fly, Black Bolt! Fly! 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 I said fly! Fly faster, damn it! Go find a safe room or something. What now? I'm gonna have to find another def checkpoint. I just I couldn't fully destroy the defense unit. It had a barrier around it. Ow! Black Bull can't take much more punishment, so gonna have to end this quickly. I missed two. Well, going to have to go up to the next. Right here. Why? Do you really want to heal? Okay. Oh, hold on. Uh, what do I do with this? Look, look. Oh, I'll always. Yeah. Okay. Now where were we? Oh yes. Blow shit up. There we go. Now I just have one more unit to blow up, and then we'll be good. Good. Hold on. Okay, yeah. We're almost, we're almost at the very end of the pure evil run through. And at that point, just gonna be get to the goal ring because I already finished the collectible mission in that one. So lucky you, lucky you. I have lucky you. I felt the need to do all that. Black Bolt to scatter shot. <laughs> there we are. The eclipse candid is nearby. Sitting in prayers and discussed the other plans. I heard this already from Neku. You don't need to talk about it jo again, Joshua. What did he say? He was talking about Dream Eaters. Oh. Well, Riku doesn't know what the hell he, what the hell he's talking about. 
I know, but that doesn't mean we need to go over it again.